So you guys know, um, everybody knows Jesse, obviously. Mm -hmm. Jesse. Yeah, everybody, Jesse's been here helping us out a lot, helping you guys a lot with uh, classes, testing, training. Uh, he's taking time away from his family to be here and help you guys for hours upon hours on a Sunday, you know, getting here early, training with everybody individually, kind of helping everybody out, getting where they need to be, and it's been showing um, how good he's been teaching you guys and the details he's been throwing at you guys. Um, so we want to do something today. Uh, Jesse, if you could turn around, please. With the baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, um, Bushido. Bushido is a proper term for a samurai code. It means the way of the warrior. There are eight virtues of Bushido. Courage, the ability to do something that frightens one. Benevolence, the quality of being well, of well-meaning and kindness. Respect, the feeling of deep admiration for someone or something allocated by their abilities, qualities, and achievements. Honor, to regard or treat someone with admiration and respect. Honesty, this quality of being truthful. Loyalty is a devotion and faithfulness to a nation, cause, philosophy, country, group, or person. Like why? Yeah. Rectitude. Morally correct behavior or thinking of righteousness. Uh, politeness. Behavior that is respectful and considerate of other people. The construction of a sword, the forging of a Japanese blade, typically took many days or weeks in what's considered a sacred art. Traditionally accompanied by a large panoply of Shinto priests. As with many complex endeavors, several artists were involved. There was a smith to forge the rough shape, often a second smith, an apprentice to fold the, fold the metal, a specialist polisher, and even a specialist for the edge. Often there, there was a sheath hilt handguard specialist as well. This sword is fashioned with water symbols, or mizu, meaning water in Japanese. It represents fluid flowing in the formless things in the world. In Japan, under the influence of the indigenous religion Shintoism, water is believed to incarnate the purity and pliant simplicity of life. A spiritual connection with elements like water is believed to be the primary force in the life of a Shinto priest. <clears throat> a samurai sword represents his soul. The sword was a symbol of the samurai class. A katana. Katanas were considered to be an extension of a samurai himself. Jesse, your loyalty and selfless service to Black Line Jiu-Jitsu Academy and its members has brought great admiration to you in the school of combat. Please accept this katana as a symbol of power, protection, authority, strength, and courage. Jesse Sefton, you are truly a modern day samurai. <laughs> Yeah. It's actually signed, uh, it's had the uh, the tag itself signed, 
Um, and when you guys pull it out, I had it custom engraved with uh, the Japanese symbol for family. Oh, so that's all fine. Touch it. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. Touch it's it's yours. Yeah. <laughs> he touches it. It's got to be right, guys. Yeah. <laughs> it's a rule. That's my justice rule. <laughs> sure. Yeah, it comes out its tight, so you got to pull it pretty hard. You didn't win that at Chuck E. Cheese. Yeah, that's not a flea market buy there. 10,000 dollars oh, there. <laughs> you can shave his head with it. You could shave your arm completely off with it. <laughs> 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 completely off. Ooh, awesome. <laughs> nice. Come on, let's see some ninja stand. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got the camera. He's I'm out of film. Film? Yeah. 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 Yeah.